Hey everybody, I'm, uh, I'm at day two of Art and Soul, and it is 7.30 and I just finished working out, so I feel really good. I uh, had my, my iPod, my water, I even refilled the water with the, um, they have the little, what do you call those things? It's like a water, I don't know what they're called. The water cooler, you know, like offices have water coolers. So now my water doesn't taste like the tap water that I had to drink yesterday when I refilled my bottle. So that's always good. Um, I was going to go run over to Target and get a few big jugs to refill it. But I think now I'm just going to go to the fitness center to do it. Um, let's see. Yeah, two classes I took yesterday. I took Make Your Mark Journaling and used my Super Deluxe Sketchbook. It's a 6 by 9 and it has 93 pound heavyweight sketch paper, which was good for water media. Um, it, it wrinkled a little bit, but it's fine for a journal. And so we worked on a page, and there's a page. We basically started off writing our thoughts, and she put on some music, and we just journaling, journaling, and even if you had nothing to say, you just wrote, I can't think of anything to write, I can't think of anything to write, and eventually something comes. Um, I didn't have any problems <laughs> with the writing part because I, I like to write and I like to journal and I don't do it nearly as much as I should. So when we had the time, the spilling just came right out. So then we went over it with, I um, can't remember if the water, oh, then we used gel pens. Um, we picked some cards from her that had like name your top five restaurants or relatives, name five relatives. And you did that in some gel pens right over on top of the writing so that there's layers of things which you can sort of see over there, over there. And then we colored it with some watercolor paints and then let that dry, then went over it with some oil pastels and it was good stuff. And we also played with melting some wax. It's just regular. It's a metallic crayon from Crayola, and we used some mini quilting iron to just melt it on. And we carved our own stamps, and I carved, my image looks sort of like that. And then, oh, and that was with Diane Trout. She was the instructor for that class, and that was, it was fun. It was a great way to start and transition from real life to the retreat. And then in the evening, I took a class with Tracy Bautista, and she's always fun because it's real free and laid back, and you come up, wind up coming out with all these papers that are beautiful colors. It's very bright, vibrant. At least that's what I do. So here, I'll share a few papers that I did. There's that. There's that. And these I used um, ledger paper because that's the kind of paper that I um, had a big stack of lying around. And someone that was next to me was so kind that was kind enough to give me a piece of regular sketch paper. So that's what this was on the back of. Then this is freezer paper, and we used it to make a monoprint, smash it on some other paper while it was wet, peel it off so then it was on two sides. And this is phone book, a page out of my phone book, and then we made collages on it. And then I can cut it up again and use it for some more collage in journal pages. And this is another one on ledger paper. So very brightly colored, fun stuff. And then today I have... Let's see what I have today. Um, during the daytime, let me grab my nifty little sheet here that I printed out. Today I have acrylic painting with glazes. And so this is some of the artist's artwork. Again, this one's again with Diane Trout that I had yesterday. And we use canvases. So we had to bring three canvases, some golden fluid acrylics, and a black pen. A 6B pencil, drawing pencil, a 6B charcoal pencil, our journal, some gesso, acrylic glazing medium, um, some paint rags. And then in the evening, I have something called Drawing Blast with Carla Sondheim. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right, but so that should be fun. And I brought yogurt this time for lunch, and so I popped some popcorn, essential stuff for me. And then I made a trail mix. And I, I made some for Mike when I left and left that with him. So maybe he'll be thinking about me. won't go too hungry. can't go hungry when you have trail mix, right? At least that's the hope. So I'm all set. Um, 
and I met some two really nice women. One, I had breakfast with her yesterday, and her name was Joey, and she spelled it a really cool way, J-O-I-E. And she's from New York and really nice and sweet, and we had a lot in common. And then for lunch, uh, for dinner, I had dinner with someone that was in my class. Her name was Janelle, and she actually lives pretty close to me and has twins that are a little bit younger than my daughter Jessica that are around, that are six and in kindergarten. And so, so far, so good. I'm having a good time. I miss everybody. I miss my family. So Mike, Jesse, Brian, if you guys are watching, link you too. I love you. I miss you. And um, I will talk to you guys later when I call. And um, so that's it. So I'll share more as, as I think more. All right. I got to go hit the shower and then go get some breakfast so I can go to my first class.